How to install Open Memories Tweak. What is good, YouTube? It's Stan One Camera Guy. I'm back at it again with another video for you. This tutorial is going to show you how to install the Open Memories Tweak app locally. Now, I've done a video in the past that shows you how to do this via browser. The Open Memories Tweak option, for those that don't know, will enable your Sony E mount camera to record, un basically, to record past the 29 minute, 50 second um, time limit that's been set by Sony. So, if you want to be able to do this, go ahead and consider doing this. I'm making this video in connection with the last video I made that showed users that firmware 2.0 for the Alpha 6300, the A7R2, A7S2 will prevent you from installing this. So you want to install this open memories tweak if you want to have the ability to record past 30 minutes. Just know that this could void your warranty. Um, so just keep that in mind. And the only thing to keep in mind is if you want to remove open memories tweak, if you just don't want it, just initialize a complete reset and this open memory suite will be removed from the application list. Let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you're gonna do is go into the description of this video. I have posted the actual links to the graphical user interface for both Windows and Mac. Download the one for your particular computer. Once you download it, you're gonna go ahead and just run the .exe or .dmg file based on your computer. Again, the process is exactly the same for both Mac and Windows. Once you run that, you're gonna, it's gonna ask you that this, pro, this application is not authorized. So for Mac, you'll have to do, you'll have to go into your private security and privacy settings to enable that. And then for Windows, just kind of work it around it and try to get the application installed. You might have to run it as an administrator if necessary. Once you have that done and you have it running, you'll see a GUI, a little application show up. You'll have camera info, install app, update firmware. Now, before you get started, what you need to do once you run the app, go ahead and get your camera. You need to go ahead and set the USB connection to MTP. If you don't do it, you won't be able to install it. Okay. Next thing we're going to do is make sure that when you have the graphical user interface or the little app installed on your computer, go ahead and go to the install app tab. You're going to go ahead and click on refresh and then click on the little triangle, the little arrow it has a drop down. We're gonna go in and choose Open Memories Tweak. Now there's other things you can install. I've never messed with them personally. So if you wanna look at those, you'll have to check them out on your own. I'm gonna click on Open Memories Tweak. And then if your camera is installed, go ahead and click on Install Selected App. And that's it. The uh, software will install and you'll be already good to go. To do that, all you have to do is go back into your camera, access the application list option, and you'll see Open Memories Tweak, and you'll be able to check off the box to do unlimited recording, or almost unlimited recording. Well, folks, if you found this video helpful, consider giving it a like. If you didn't like it, give it a dislike. And with that said, I'm your host, Alan Camera Guy, and I'll catch you on the next video. Bye.